currently raining a bunch, um, but I just had the event yet the other day, and I was thinking because that thing that I had mentioned where, you know, you do some talking to people whatnot, and then the next day you figure out like, oh yeah, I could have had something better to say, because people will ask, what do you do at these networking events? And sometimes I think I've got a pretty good response, but most of the time my brain just like leaves my head and I'm just like stuck there like deer in the headlights. Uh, I was like, yeah, at the time if I'm like holding my camera, I was like, oh yeah, sure, I do video, like blogs and whatnot. I'm heading into the office right now and you know, there's that whole like, I'm here drawing blanks. What's going on today, guys? So I was trying to think of what to record for today. I didn't like storyboard or anything like that. I was, however, going to like, I, I got back here. I looked at my desk. There's like one piece of color on here, Nintendo Switch. I haven't really touched it in a number of months. And I was like, oh, I could do like a Nintendo Switch review, but I wouldn't honestly feel comfortable reviewing something that I really haven't, like haven't realistically touched. And point being, didn't feel comfortable actually trying to make a review on something that I don't actually use that often. Like I've used it and there was one week where I was like kind of kind of sick, but you know, maybe not so much, but kind of maybe a little bit. I might have spent 130 hours running through The Legend of Zelda and, you know, trying to 100% that game. Yeah, maybe one day that will come when I get some more time, like more hours logged in there playing other games and actually using the system. But anyways, not the point of this video. I'm actually just gonna go and hang out over at my brother's place, not do work maybe a little bit or do, do work a little bit, I'm not. We'll figure it out. Yeah, so that's gonna be today's video and uh, get some B-roll in there. Just, I really do need to practice getting more B-roll, capturing it and making it look cinematic. Like right now, I know there's some grainy footage, not entirely sure, like, you know, I don't always use the best lighting. So, I mean, even outdoors, like there's wa there's ways to capture footage outside that, that looks better than what I've been doing. Anyways, that's today. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, shoot some of that. So um, yeah, let's go, ready? And I'm gonna go. <laughs> Alright, uh, quick pit stop for food, and uh, then I'll complete my journey, but yeah, alright, food. Boom. So that was, uh, that was some really short b-roll, actually. <laughs> and this time, I guess the biggest difference from the, sh the shots in this video versus the last one was, this one I primarily used the Osmo gimbal to get the footage, whereas the last time, I was using using this and using my hands actually to hold the the camera. One of the biggest differences when you're shooting and you're holding with a phone, like it's you're gonna get shaky footage. Like no matter what you do, it's gonna be shaky. And with the gimbal, it's like a lot less so. Uh, even still, I gotta get like better at knowing what situations I can get certain types of foot of shots in. So just gotta practice more, watch and see what kind of shots other people are getting in their videos and like try to replicate that as best I can. All in all though, um, you know, it was a fairly successful day when hung out with my, uh, you know, the nephew for a little bit. Boom. So that was fun. I don't know, short vlogs are nice. Like, they're nice sometimes. So that's it for now. And I will catch you in the next one.